I will show you how to write up the data for Turnip Peroxidase Lab. You should have the recent JMP downloaded onto your computer. First, we're going to analyze data for range finding. Open up the Excel file. You will copy and paste B1 to B11 under A1 to A11. Repeat this step for B through H. Next, I'm manually putting in the time, starting from zero, then adding 20 seconds until 120 seconds, because the plate reads it as every 20 seconds for two minutes. Copy and paste for the rest of the column. Highlight all the data, likewise. Copy and paste it into Jump. Next, label all your columns as shown. Click Graph and Graph Builder. Time in seconds will be on your x-axis and all the dilutions will be on your y-axis. Drop down to Summary Statistics and choose Mean, then Arrow Bars and pick Standard Deviation. On the drop-down button next to Graph Builder, remove Title and Footer as shown. Click over the legend and modify it. Then click on the vertical values and go to Axis Settings, set it to three decimal places. Change your axis label with the appropriate units. Click Done and save your graph with the report. I chose the 1 to 6 dilution because my line was linear but not flat. Next, we are going to analyze data for different enzyme concentration. Repeat the steps from part 1. Instead of labeling it concentration 1 or 2, etc., you should label it 0.25 times the enzyme, etc., like the protocol indicated. Fit your data on a linear line and display the equation this time.
go back to Excel, your x-axis is all the different concentrations of enzyme, and your y-axis is all the corresponding slopes. Copy and paste with labels into jump as shown. Enzyme amount is x axis and slope is y-axis. Choose to display a linear line with the R2 value. Modify the graph as shown. This is your enzyme concentration graph. I am analyzing data for substrate concentration last. Repeat all the steps to organize the data for jump. Label your columns as shown. The data analysis for this last graph mimics part two. Again, slopes of all substrate concentration is y-axis and different substrate concentration is x-axis.
go to Graph Builder and don't forget to change sig figs and modify the graph as shown.